Have you ever felt dizzy or terrified at great heights? This unsettling sensation is more than common, and it's known as acrophobia, an extreme or irrational fear of heights. It's a fear that can grip anyone from the bravest of adventurers to the most cautious among us. In this video, we're going to unravel the mystery behind acrophobia, discussing its causes and symptoms and how it can affect everyday life. Now that we have established what acrophobia is, let's delve into its causes. So what causes someone to develop acrophobia? Well, the root causes of acrophobia can differ greatly from person to person. For some, it could be a learned response stemming from a traumatic event, perhaps a childhood incident on a towering roller coaster or a precarious tree climb gone wrong. Others may inherit this fear from our ancestors. Picture early humans navigating the world where survival meant steering clear of cliffs and high places. This fear of heights became ingrained in the human psyche, passed down through generations and may still linger in some of us today. Additionally, our brain's natural defense mechanisms can play a part. When we're up high, our brain perceives a threat. This triggers a fear response, which can lead to acrophobia. It's a classic case of the body trying to protect us, but in this scenario, it's from a danger that's often not immediate or real. Now that we understand the causes of acrophobia, let's explore its symptoms. How does acrophobia manifest itself? Well, if you've ever felt your heart pounding at the thought of climbing a ladder, or felt your palms go clammy when looking out of a high window, you may be experiencing symptoms of acrophobia. This fear of heights can trigger a variety of physical and emotional responses. Dizziness is a common symptom, often accompanied by a sensation of being off balance. Nausea can also be a telltale sign, making the thought of high places feel physically sickening. Sweating and trembling are also frequent indicators. You might notice your heart racing as if you've just run a marathon, even though you're standing still. This rapid heartbeat is often a response to perceived danger, even when you're safe on solid ground. And then, there's that overwhelming desire to get down or stay away from high places. This symptom can be so powerful that it can prevent you from enjoying activities that involve heights. These are the common symptoms of acrophobia, but remember, everyone's experience can be different. So, we have explored the causes and symptoms of acrophobia. Let's recap. Acrophobia is an irrational fear of heights that can stem from various roots, each unique to the individual. It can cause physical symptoms like dizziness and nausea, transforming an ordinary situation into a terrifying ordeal. Understanding these key points is crucial as it enables us to empathize with and potentially assist those who grapple with this condition. The more we understand about acrophobia, the better we can help those who suffer from it. Thanks for tuning in and remember knowledge is power.